Hello, it's Jim from JetsonHacks.com. Today's screencast is part two of the Jetson Car software install. Let's go. After installing ROS in part one of our software series, we're ready to install the MIT packages for the race car. There are some convenience scripts on the Jetson Hacks account on GitHub in a repository called install race car. Let's clone that repository. We'll grab the address, git clone. We'll switch over to that repository's directory. Let's take a look at the script. Install racecar.sh. Our default directory is racecar-ws in the home directory. You can override that if you'd like. The first step is to download the file racecar.ros install. And then we use this WS tool to download package goodness. Next, we source the devil, and then we use rostep to install the dependencies. This minus R will skip errors. There's an error in the OpenCV dependency in the Z wrapper, so that is useful. And then we have this JS test, which will help us find out when our game controller is actually working. We set up some configuration parameters. We use the static CUDA for our OpenCV linkage because the Jetson has some issues with that. And then we run catkin make. So let's do all of that. Clear this off. Install race car. Here we go. Okay, so now all of the software packages are installed. We only have one more step before we can actually drive the car, and that's to fix up the VESC firmware and set its parameters. That's in the next episode. Thanks for watching.